Hey, what is up nation? In this session, I'm gonna be teaching you how to live sync your SketchUp models with Lumion. All right, so I've come into SketchUp and I've gone to the 3D Warehouse and I've imported this model here. Uh, and I've also, as you can see, a link to the description in the below to this model, uh, cause I want to give the original creator credit. Uh, and then I've also installed this plugin called Lumion Live Sync. So uh, you can search the extension warehouse for uh, Lumion Live Sync. And I'll also have a description down below, but it's probably easier to just type that in. So once you have that, that installed, and then you also need to have purchased or have a trial version of uh, Lumion. So I have that here. Uh, so I'm gonna go to, you pick basically like a, a default to start with, a default landscape. Uh, I tend to use the mountain range because it puts something in the background uh, that's nice, uh, but gives you sort of like this plane to work with. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna stick with this and then, uh, what you need to do is, uh, this is unsaved currently, so I need to save it. And uh, you'll get a prompt if you don't do this, so we're gonna call this uh, Persian City. I think that's something to the effect of what it's called. Uh, and then you just come up to super simple. Uh, you just come up here and you just click Start Live Sync. Now what's gonna happen in Lumion is that it will eventually import, I think. Yeah, you can see it's freezing right now because it's importing and it's in here. So um, you can see right now I'm having an issue with the grass. I mean, you can see the grass is conflicting with that. So if I open SketchUp and normally you don't see this in the videos that I've done because uh, I have a separate window and I only record one window. So in this, you get to see me switching between the two. So um, I'm just gonna select this. Um, this is not modeled nicely. <laughs> that should have been a group, okay? I did that, I deleted it, hit uh, Control S to save, because I'm on a PC. Uh, and you can see that that is gone. So you can see my Persian city and it just looks just without doing any rendering, just how much better it looks in Lumion. Just look at the contrast there. Um, you can also do it. There's these two buttons here. This is to stop syncing. You can also uh, stop your camera synchronization um, so that the camera itself, uh, if I model this on the other window, it'll essentially keep the view from SketchUp in Lumion, which is fine uh, if you're modeling uh, something, but I've actually noticed in a previous video, and, and for, for me doing this, it like clips a lot of stuff uh, in the uh, in Lumion when you do that. So uh, just a really simple tutorial uh, because everybody's been asking a lot of questions of how am I doing what I'm doing, uh, and it's been confusing because I, you're seeing everything in Lumion because it looks nicer. Um, and it's fast, so I don't know how much people can learn from SketchUp when it's all sped up and I'm doing a speed model. Uh, but maybe I'll just do everything in the same window or I'm not sure what I'll do in the, in the future. But let me know in the comments below if you guys have any suggestions. Um, I think it's fun to see this because it looks so pretty. Um, but uh, maybe it's more helpful to have SketchUp uh, so you can see what I'm modeling. So uh, let me know in the comments below uh, if you thought that this was helpful, if it added some clarity because you guys were confused. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And as always, happy hacking. All right, designers. Just because this episode of Designer Hacks is over doesn't mean we're leaving you out in the cold. Tony's got tons of great content available at designerhacks.com. So join Design Nation right now, and we'll see you on the next episode of Designer Hacks.